So we take a look at the big board tonight to look at the Electoral College map. Remember, it takes 270 Electoral College votes to win the presidency. Tonight we have 201 for Hillary Clinton, 164 for Donald Trump. Now, this is the map. Red, the blue, the gray states are key battleground states. As of tonight, if the election were tonight, in the average of polls, even if it's a razor thin lead, this is how it would go down. Hillary Clinton would pick up Nevada, Colorado, Iowa, Wisconsin, Michigan, Ohio, Pennsylvania, New Hampshire, Virginia, North Carolina, and Florida. Donald Trump would win as of tonight in the average of polls, Arizona, and Georgia, although Georgia's close. That's the map. Look at the map. 347 Electoral College votes for Hillary Clinton, 191 for Donald Trump. Hillary Clinton would win the presidency with a landslide Electoral College win as of tonight. Obviously, anything can change in four weeks, but this is what the map looks like. A couple of other interesting numbers. The Elections Project says that 34% of Americans will cast their ballots early, either early voting in their state, absentee ballots. Some key states where that is happening, Florida, 2.7 million Floridians will vote early. There are already about 50,000 votes in. And here you see the breakdown. Republicans 43% to Democrats 38. North Carolina, roughly 160,000 early votes, 26,000 so far. It's tied at 37%. And here in Iowa, roughly 260,000 early votes, 88,000 so far. And this is upside down. Democrats 56%, Republicans 26. Iowa is a place that Donald Trump has a slight lead as of now. If you look at this map, Florida is a key spot with 29 electoral votes. That is where Hillary Clinton is tonight with a blast from the past. Jennifer Griffin is covering the Clinton campaign.